Hi everyone, it's the English Simmer here, and today we're gonna be talking about one of my favorite topics to talk about recently, which is strange because I never ever see myself living in the countryside or like actually partaking in this lifestyle, but that is farming in The Sims, because just a couple of weeks ago, I was gonna say last week, but time doesn't exist in my brain right now, I was talking about how much I miss farming in The Sims 4 and how we don't really have any objects. Like we got a couple in Eco Lifestyle and we have off the grid living and we have gardening, but we technically don't have like any animal products or anything really that feels like a traditional farm setting. But that's all about to change thanks to this mod made by Panda Summer and also Mizor Yuki and Ice Mun Mun, who are some of my favorite creators out there for The Sims 4 custom content. I have used Ice Mun Mun stuff before in the past. They actually did a chicken coop, I think, like back when Get to Work was out. So they've been making content for years now, and now they've made a custom content cow or cows, however many you want. So we're gonna take my first look at this mod. I've read the information about it. Like I said, I'll leave the Patreon down below if you wanna go support them. Editing me here, but they're currently hoping for a public release around the 4th of March. Right now, it's only available as early access on their Patreon. So I will link each of them down below. And they did very kindly gift me this link just for full transparency. I think it's so sick when custom content content creators are like, hey, I want to provide you with this because I know you're interested in it. Mm, I love it. But I really appreciate them sending it over to me because I am such a big nerd about farming, apparently. I never thought this would be my niche. Here we are. So what I've done is I downloaded this hindquarter hideaway farm off the gallery by Smudge It. It's really, really adorable. I placed it down in Brindleton Bay. I also, sorry V, but I'm married to Alice in this save file. What can I say? I love Alice and therefore I feel like we can live the cottage core gay lifestyle on a farm that we all deserve. And I just created like this crappy little shed over here for me to put my cows in. So we have treat bag for cow, open to get some treats to feed your cow by Ice Mun Mun. So we're gonna place this down over here. We're just gonna get one of them for now. This actually contains seeds. And if you feed these seeds to your cow, you get different variants of milk. So you have this cow in your buy mode catalog and it says start your farming dreams by purchasing a cute cow or an entire herd. Just place the sign down in a grassy area to encourage grazing or your barn with hay if you prefer for them to be indoors. And choose from several color and pattern options. Name, talk to, pet, and feed them a variety of treats to collect different types of milk that you can sell, cook with, or enjoy a fresh bottle of. So we're just gonna go for two cows for now, I think. That's what we'll run with. Obviously that costs you zero simoleons, but you do actually have to pay for the cows. Hay collected from the hay bale, feed this to your bovine friend. We also have a hay pile, collect hay to feed to your cow or place the hay pile near your cow to automatically feed them. Store milk to keep it fresh, open it to grab bottles of milk. So there's a milk canister. And then these are also all the seeds that you can get in the seed packet. And we obviously have some of milk. So there's coconut milk, banana milk, ginger milk, cherry milk, whole different variety of milks. And these milks also give you different emotions as you drink them. So you can have a white cow with brown patches, white cow with reddish brown patches, white cow with black patches, gray patches, dark brown cow, russet cow, or a tan cow. I'm gonna go for the black patches because, oh, you're standing this way? Okay, that's fine. I wonder if I can like move them in build and buy. I can. Okay, I'm gonna move this, this little one here. Oh, he's got a little head over. Oh my actual word. I'm screaming already. It's so cute. Look at it, oh my god, and its tail moves, and it just, oh, it looks so cute. And then for this one, I'm gonna go for a tan cow. 
Oh my god, look at your eyes, you are beautiful. I have a little moodlet over here, which is a happy moodlet from New Cow. Looks like a new cow has joined the household. Now, what to name it? <gasps> name oh you're called amber okay i'll leave you i'll leave you as amber oh and now it comes up as amber i mean that does move around a little bit as the cow moves um but that's fine and then this one i will call you i mean i guess all cows are girls but you're gonna be andrew who says you can't be called andrew you can absolutely be called andrew so this one, we can now dairy the cow. You can't dairy them, you can't milk them when they're full. However, you can do it when they start to empty a little bit. So we're gonna open this seed packet, hopefully. That goes into our inventory. We got some plasma fruit and we got pistachio. We're gonna go feed a pistachio to little miss amber over here you just fed the cow they can be fed again after four hours grab the pistachio milk yes i get to milk my cow <laughs> i am living the dream like i said i've never wanted to do this in real life like i've never wanted to like get into agriculture oh pats for amber yeah you get pats wow and we're like full on milking, like with a bucket and everything. I'm in awe. I freaking love this. If you love this type of gameplay, if you have like a farm, fed the cow. I just fed the cow. Now I can collect some milk. So we got this milk. Oh, okay. It went from pistachio to cherry. We're gonna open that. Oh, now it says pistachio. Okay, that just seems like a little bit of a bug. Just keep in mind that this is a mod and I'm sure they will continue to work on it. That is bright green. <laughs> oh, I mean, pistachio ice cream is also green, so it makes sense. I wonder what moodlet we're gonna get off this pistachio milk though. There we go, we are happy. Verdant milk. Green, nutty, delicious, and nutritious. Drink up, but I gotta go for a pee pee. <laughs> oh, I think this one's grazing on the grass. That's so damn cute. So you can also ask it about its day, talk to it, and also yell at it. So you can get up your relationship with these cows. So we're gonna go ask amber about her day and also talk to her i know it looks like i'm ignoring andrew oh andrew's actually oh there we go was hungry and is now okay so he's definitely either grazing on the grass or on the hay amber has turned up in our little relationship panel we can see and i do have UI cheats on. So what I'm gonna do is bring that up to a 35 because once you actually, I think it's once you get over 30, you can pet the cow. Has a little love heart on its head. Oh my God, I would genuinely die for you. Amber, I love you. You're an angel. I will defend you with my life. Oh my god, we're giving you good strokes. Oh, and a kiss. And a kiss on your little snout. <laughs> I'm loving this. Divine bovine. What a friendly, gentle giant. Because we are now friends with Amber. <gasps> She's lying down for her sleep. Oh my god. Amber, you sweet bean. I'm actually like loving this i am in love with these cows i never want to take this mod out of my game i have to say it i want it to stay forever i want cows in every single save file i play from now on if you don't have cows you're just not playing the sims 4 are you let's be real oh my god the little slow walk and everything i would actually die for you but we're gonna get their relationship up to 100 for amber and then if you shift click on oh, this is so sad i kind of didn't want to test this i was like oh am i gonna do this i'm sorry vegans and vegetarians please forgive me if you watch my content i just wanted to explore this mod in its fullest capacity you can enable meat collection and we can send the cow to the shop choosing this will permanently send the cow away you will receive meat in return for recipes or for selling 
I'm sorry, Amber. I love you. And also with this mod, it works from children to like elders as well. So children can also interact with the cows, which is so damn sweet. And that is pretty much the cow mod. It's called the Dairy Cow Mod collaboration. I am such a big fan of this. I think this is so cute. I think they've done like the animations really, really well. And I did get it wrong. It doesn't actually actually change like your emotional state. They're all happy. Every single milk that you get is happy. However, you can get like different flavored ones. So depending on what you feed your cows, you'll get a different flavor. It just is all happy. So my bad, that was my misinformation. But yeah, if you're like me and you've been missing farming in The Sims 4, I hope this brightened up your day a little bit. Obviously this is only available to those of you who can play with mods on PC. Unfortunately, consoles still don't have that accessibility on them, but thank you all so much for tuning in. I hope you enjoyed this little overview of me living my gay cottagecore lifestyle in The Sims 4. And I will speak to you all in my next video. Bye now.